Hi guys, welcome to this session on Microsoft Word. In this module, I want to look at three things. One, how to compare two documents. Two, how to combine two documents. And three, how to combine text from several documents into one file. So first of all, the compare feature. Now, I've clicked onto the review tab. And then over on the right here, you've got compare and combine. So I'll do compare first. So this is basically comparing two versions of the same document. And you'd basically, you basically need to find the two versions. So I've got test is the original. And then test one is the revised document. So that's the two that I want to combine. And then I click OK. And then it shows me this screen, which is okay and it's got highlighted the differences but to be fair that's not the best look i don't think when you're using this feature so if you click on this down arrow again and go into this option you can you can see what it's on there but you can also click this so original or revise or both and when you click on both the screen splits down like this so you have the original document you have the revised document you have the compared document in the middle and then you have the changes and the revisions on the left hand side so obviously there's a change between the two here and it's highlighted at the bottom there this was not on the original now it is on the revised document now i can if i want just um, accept that and then it tells me there's no track changes left and then that's taken the revision out of there and that's now accepted that so that's one way that you can use to compare documents now if i just close this down i'm not saving that now to combine documents is a similar feature so if i go back to there that was compare combine click on combine again i'm gonna pick up the same two documents test and test one and then click ok now, this is the combined document. Looks exactly the same, but it's, when I click um, accept this, it is going to create a separate document, which you can then save and call it whatever you want. So then take this off. Don't need to see these anymore. Hide source documents. And then this is the document you can do a save as on uh, whatever you want to, but that's how you combine the documents. So basically you're comparing two revisions to see what the changes are, if any, and accepting or rejecting or not even doing any of that. You maybe just want to call back to your client. If it's a client that sent that in and said, there's this change that's been made, I need you to have a look at that. And then use comments and refer back and forward until you're happy with the, um, the changes and then accept them. Uh, combining two documents, um, you may have had a, a document that, um, at university maybe that a tutor's marked and you want to combine the comments into your document to move forward and then to edit edit it as you're going forward so the other way the third way is if i just close this one down i'm not going to save that is that you can use the insert object feature so i've got inserts and then over on the right there you've got object um, and i want to bring just the text in so this doesn't work too well if you've got image it says text from file and that's what it it does what it says on the tin, so text. And then I'm going to bring these three files in. So I'm just going to hold my shift key down, and click on those three files, and then click insert. And it just brings this the text in for those three files. So that was file one, file two, and file three. So that brings it in nice and neat. And that's how you can bring text from three different documents into one document. Very quick, very easy. Uh, the other one was combining and the other one was comparing so all three features are available there is another feature that you could use to bring uh, multiple documents together and that is using the master document feature which i've already got a video on that so you can have a look through the word playlist to see that video but for now that's all i want to talk about for, for today so thank you for your time and i'll see you soon